What's going on, buddy? My name's Chris, and welcome back to more Let's Play Undertale. Last episode, we battled our greatest enemy, and then we kind of started dating, question mark. He's a skeleton. Off screen, like I promised, I went and healed up at the inn, and I also got a bunch of cinnamon buns and another bicycle. Spent pretty much all my money. I like 200 G's. But yeah. Anyways, let's enter the house, because he invited me to his house. What the heck is going on upstairs? Is that a fire? This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. <laughs> can we go in here? Oh, we can. Let's take a look at the stove. My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking something. It was like a quench, but filled with sugary, non egg substance. How absurd! That's a trash can. Feel free to visit at any time. <laughs> Aha! Just in my food museum. Please, per peruse my culinary art show. Half the fridge is filled with containers, all labeled spaghetti. <laughs> the other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. What the heck is up with the sink beside me here? Why is it so tall? Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones underneath it. Take a look, see. <gasps> Puppy! What? Catch our meddling canine! Curses! <laughs> Sans! That was his name, right? I can't remember his last name or his name last episode. Stop plugging my life with that incidental music. It's a dirty sock with series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You move it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. Don't bring it back. <laughs> okay. It's still here. Can you just say not to bring it back to my room. <laughs> Forget it! Oh my god, it's amazing. Oh, I see. They weren't having that conversation. Those are all the notes. Touch the couch. It makes a jingling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20G! Yay! Oh, it's my favorite game show! It says, stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. It's the book? The joke book. Take a look inside? Of course. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. <laughs> Welcome to Scenic to my to Welcome to Scenic My House Tour. Enjoy it and take your time. That's my room! If you finish looking around, you go in and do whatever people do when they date. Oh god, it's weird. Not yet. The bone. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. Bones. The door is locked. No. Oh. That's my room. Okay, let's... Uh, okay, this is, this is gonna be weird. Let's do it. Yeah, I guess. <gasps> what? This is an amazing room! <laughs> hey, those are the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday, even though it was basically it just basically happened. Well, it was two days ago, really. That's my bed! If I ever get to the surface, I like to drive it drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead I cruise while I snooze. <laughs> so, um you've seen everything. Do you wanna start the date? Not yet, no 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 no. Take your time, I'll wait for you. Ah, yes, action figures. <laughs> a great reference to the theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. I don't know what that means. Yeah, that's right. Santa! <laughs> Isn't that flaking needle? I'm dying, found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons! <laughs> uh, uh, that book's one of my favorites. Advanced puzzle construction for critical minds. The next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. Here, Jeanette, I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away. From a double digit following count. Oh my god. 
Of course, fame has its steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. It's totally not sans or anything. The computer's internet browser is open to a social media site. Can we go this way? There are no skeletons inside my closet, except me sometimes. Look inside the closet? Sure. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Alright, let's, let's do the date. Okay, let's start the date. Okay, dating start! What? You have to battle him again? Dating start! Here we are, on our date! I've actually never done this before. I never imagined. But don't worry, you can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. <laughs> I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. Ready to have a great time? Let's see. Step one. Press the C key on your keyboard for dating hub. What the heck is this? Wow, we have feel so informed! I think we're ready for step two! Step two, ask them on a date. What is this? Reel it in. Population egg. Sat. Like Saturday. Dog radar. That, that sounds useful. Catching them on crime! Ahem! Human! I the great papyrus. We're going on a date with you. Really? Oh wow, I didn't even see I had an option there. I guess that means it's time for part three! Step three. Put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait a second. For clothing? A bandana on your head. You're wearing clothing right now! Not only that, earlier today, you're also wearing clothing! <gasps> no! Could it be? You've wanted to date me from the very beginning? Oh, hopefully I clicked yes. I hate No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No! No! Your dating power! Nah, nah. Don't think you've best of me yet. I, the great papyrus, I've never been beaten by e beaten at dating, and I never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes, in case someone happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Oh my God, cool dude. <laughs> yeah, what do you think of my secret style? Well, he says, yeah, reminds me of Yu Yu the Abride series. A little Karibo on YouTube. No! A genuine compliment! <laughs> However, also, his hat doesn't move with his face. It's really concerning to me. You don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid! This day won't escalate any further. Unless you find my secrets. But that won't happen! We're gonna inspect with Z. So, holding my hand, so I'll tell you the answer. No, I must resist. <laughs> do I? Do I dare? Let's go to this foot first. Human souls are stronger than monster souls. The souls of our shoes, on the other hand, <laughs> are about the same. Okay, he just says the same thing. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work. Oh God. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm, you know, I'm, that's gotta be the thing everyone does. Sure didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Ex expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. My hat, my hat, my hat! <laughs> dun dun dun! Ooh. Well then, you found my secret. What is it? Oh, it's a present. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. Present j just for you. Open it. <gasps> it's spaghetti! Do you know this? what this is? No idea. Of course. Spaghetti! Yay! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right! But oh, so wrong. Say plain old pasta. This is an artis artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti, finely aged in an oak and cask. And cooked by me, Master Chef Pepperus. Human! It's time to end this! There's no way this could go any farther. Let's eat it! If you take a small bite, your face reflectively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking! And by extension, me! Maybe even more than I do! Ah! Ah! No! <laughs> Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake! Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you I, Papyrus, I, um, boy, is it hot here or is it just me? Hmm. Oh shoot, human eye. I'm sorry. 
I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, I was supposed to go on a date with you. <laughs> and then on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I've only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion, with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong! I can't feel anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend. And act like this all never happened. After all, you act very great. Or you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. <laughs> and hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. <laughs> it's his brother! Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime, platonically. <laughs> well, I gotta go! <laughs> well then. Very interesting. I don't know why the closet just called my name or something. I love how his door is like a typical teenage boy. Oh no, I didn't mean to go in there. Alright. I'm guessing puppy isn't- no, okay, puppy isn't here. The sink is so tall! Oop. The sink is so tall you can't wash your hands. Alright, let's go back outside. Is puppy gonna be around here? If anything, I bet he went to the werewolf because, you know, that's where- that's where I would go, right? Nope, he's not here. Just- just werewolf throwing freaking ice cubes. I'm really wondering what the heck was that other way with, you know, with the glowing- The glowing rocks I could light up and there was a door there? I had no idea what that was, and I hope- I mean, it didn't look like there's anything I'd do, and it, 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 like, there was no hints for a code, right? I don't know, there's also the shack here. It's locked from the inside, I don't know how to get in there. Alright, guess we'll move on. It's time to move on- ooh, it's getting all icy again, that's not good. Oh, it just stopped. Oh, for a second I thought the path ended, I was like, uh-oh, dead end. What's this? Things I can't examine. I see. Hey! He's here! I forgot his name again. Hans? No, it's some four letter name. Yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome. She's the coolest, right? I wanna be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell me my parents I'm here. Haha. <laughs> oh my god, this person is scary. Their eye and their tooth moves when they talk. This is an echo flower. It represents the last thing it heard over and over again. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over again. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Yay! Checkpoint! What? Have you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs mean twice as many legally required breaks. I want a girl bees. Want to come? Yeah, why not? Oh, if you insist. I'll pry myself away from work. Over here, I know a shortcut. Ooh, let's go. Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Sans, that's what it is. Hi, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hiya, Sansy. Hey, Sans, weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? <laughs> yeah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. <laughs> Must be thinking of brunch. Here, get comfy. Oh my god. Whoops. I sure you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the- Ah, someone did tell me to watch where I sit down here too. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? I want a burger. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Girlby, we'll have a double order of burg. <laughs> Burgy! So, what do you think? Oh, my brother. He's very cool. Of course he's cool. He'd be cool too if you wore the outfit every day. You only take that thing off if you absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. By that I mean, he wears it in the shower, oh god. <laughs> uh, yay, delicious burgers, here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Yes! Bon appetit! Oh, I thought I was going to tell me to go get it from that one we saw forever ago. You tip the ketchup. The cap falls off and all the ketchup in the bottle pours into your food. Whoops. Well, that, I'd be okay with that because I love ketchup. Hey, forget about it, you can have mine. I'm not hungry anyway. 
Don't scratch your butt in front of me, sir! Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree, Papyrus tries really hard. Like how he keeps trying to be part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was, it was midnight, but the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's uh, still a work of progress. Hey, it's a pretty hard battle. He was a good warrior. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. <gasps> have you ever heard of a talking flower? Yep, I have. So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. You say something to them and they'll repeat it over and over. I thought you were talking about the flower at the beginning of the game. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes when no one else is around, the flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Interesting. Very interesting. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you, you pull me away from work that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you put the bill? It's just 10,000 gold. Sure, why not? Just kidding. It'll be put on my tab. Hey, man, I would totally pay that. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. <laughs> very interesting, very interesting indeed. Uh, Grills, Grills said that your food is probably cold by now. No one ate a dang thing. Anyways, I suppose we're gonna call it up something. Oh, I hit the wrong. Oh, hitting control also brings up the menu instead of C. Interesting. I'm gonna call it an episode there, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving a like and subscribing to the video or subscribing to my channel. If there's any games you want to see me play, uh, check out the top link in my description. It leads you to a video that lets you leave suggestions for games for me to play. I had the feeling that the the bone dog that ran away was gonna be up there, but nope. Um, yeah. Next one, we will leave town, I guess, and head out into the grand world and take another step closer to leaving this place. Also, I really miss Goat Mom. Can we call Papyrus' phone? Ring, ring. Snowden, home of Papyrus. That's the slogan, right? <laughs> Real? Nobody picked up. Oh, she just disappeared from existence. How sad. <sighs> so many sad. So much ice. Let's just make it to where we were and then end of the episode. So much ambient sounds. I wonder what's going to be next. I mean, those skeletons were pretty much the entire game. It was Go Mom and then the skeletons, and now both those are pretty much done with. Alright, talk to you guys later.